They said one side. Oh, it's Ness. Another Ness. All right. Earth guy makes sense. Earthbound. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of Nesses here today. Yeah. Ooh. I'm actually surprised with the amount of like Nesses. Ness is a pretty popular character, I think. Like, there's a lot of underutilized characters I've seen so far today. Like, especially like Big D, of course, is the the resident ice climbers. Yeah. I think there's like four or five Ivysaurs. Yeah, there's a lot which, of Ivysaurs. Which I'm actually really surprised by because I thought me and Mama Juice were like the two in Washington. Yeah, we got one over in Central, and I think there's one in uh, Eastern, too. Uh, that. Oh, oh, there it is. He's, Oh, he and that loves his uh, flip stools. Trades with that. Aggie shakes his head. Oh, a shakes his head again. Yeah, he just <laughs> mi just missed space that. And so neutral air, um, it works a little bit like uh, links up beyond the ground, where if the first yeah. hit connects, the second hit will it will disappear. So, no. Yeah. Sorry, Jamie. Um, you did not miss Crow's match. It was played off stream. Huh. Anyway, so yeah, back to the match. Yeah, Earth guy, he's just taking a quick break, taking a breather up on up on the platform. Ooh, it's a try and re man grab. recollect himself. See, he's, he's got to find a way to get in here. Oh, you got to be able to punish that yeah. that shield. If you're if you're able to shield side B, you got to be able to punish that. Ooh, mm -hmm. goes for the walk. Get someone to get up attack. Uh, that uh, that nair on shield is not totally safe. Um, because it only hits that one time. You can like wave dash forward and punish it out of shield. A little bit difficult. Oh, but good cool. space back air there. Mm -hmm. This is looking pretty clean by Aggie. Yeah. Very strong contender for the top two, I, I would yeah. say. Yeah. A little bit early on that PK flash. Who else in bracket is looking pretty solid so far? Um, Aki is looking extremely great in Aki. bracket today. He well, beat out Big D. He beat Big D, beat Punk Panda. He is playing extremely well today, and it's going to be good to see what he can do tomorrow for top. What about eight. this bracket? Like, who do you think could? This yeah. bracket, I'm looking to Chief, see. Chief definitely. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to see uh, Chief versus Bladewise. So I think oh, Bladewise, Bladewise is in this bracket. Because Bladewise is in this bracket, he's. We're going to wait for him. He's going to be playing Shanks, who is not the Shanks that I know. <laughs> oh, and two then, Shanks. Yeah, there's a there's a Shanks who went to Bellingham, which is now in Issaquah, and I he's think a, I know that one. Yeah, he's a really solid fox who's. He's, a, he's either 10th on the PR in melee, or he's like 11th or 12th. Like, he's right there. And then yeah. Contra, who... Cameron. Yeah, like, Cameron, yeah. yeah. And so I'm looking forward to see that. I'm pretty sure they play at EPG quite a lot. Yeah. But Chief looked like he was playing really solid. I was playing with him earlier, and he was playing really well. Yeah, I still need to go uh, rematch Chief. Zeddy is also really interesting. I have a money match with him later. <laughs> Game & Watch is a very interesting character. He is character. a character. Who, yeah, if you <laughs> down throw, down tilts are... Up throw, up airs. Yeah. To lots, up, of, lots of options for Game & Watch. Up B to jumping Nair is really solid. So it's like Game & Watch can be, it's very combo heavy, but if you don't get those combos, there's not much you can do. Game & Watch is a character that has a bunch of different styles, and you got to kind of like know the matchup to be playing against them. Well, we got some match goal here. Right. I, I like I like the counter pick for Ness, seeing for the extra platform. Mm -hmm. But Wario has the same thing, where he has another another mode of recovery that's very easy, or another mix up. And Wario's recovery sometimes so good, sometimes okay. Yeah, that air mobility really. Wow, that oh, and that DI. Ooh, that was. I think he was hoping to like roll through him or something. Yeah, that had to be. Seem to be doing that earlier. Ooh, but that was a really. That was not a well space. <laughs> Gets the balloon. Upbeat. He got the balloon too, so he's currently winning. That's good. It may be even stocks, but he's winning. I think we need to have like whenever Smashville comes up, we need to have a counter, like a balloon counter of who wins each match. Oh, it's too much work for Robo. <laughs> he may be scum, but what are you talking about? I mean, <laughs> he may be absolutely we can overwork scum, him, right? But he he doesn't need that much work. <laughs> Um, Teamer, the Axie, the A-Team crew battle will probably oh. be tomorrow. That was close. Ooh, that was, that, that was, playing that a, was a much better, better DI, because that, yeah. that was around the same percent as the last kill, and it was even on a platform, so yeah. that was... Right next to the edge. Oh, oh and then the mid again. Thank you, was trying to get the Nair. Tech. 
Aggie might have been looking for the but Earth guy is playing. He's doing much better this game with his spacing. Yeah, and his di that, like he died the uh, forward beat. So like four throw. That's and it. yeah, that's gonna take it. But his his spacing has been much better this game in terms of. Oh yeah, I'm noticing a large improvement. Oh, ooh, a lot closer game. Oh, <laughs> the taunt. He taunted. Wow. And I, and I, you and know Earth what? guy got. Blue because I think of it was too. a flub because he had yeah. his taunt on one of his buttons for football. Oh. Because for the footstool yeah. option. Yeah, he's really good at those. Mm -hmm. Might do it right now. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Oh. oh. A little bit it's too high. Thing. I hope Aggie doesn't suck himself out. Like, that happens yeah. sometimes. But he's he's given the option to Earth Guy to get in there. He's getting his fares, but back air. Back yeah. So many scares. Do you know what's the best way to DI that down throw to not get back air no like idea. that? I have no idea. So I feel like if you were to DI away, oh, and that's a dead. Uh, he wasted Ooh. the walk. Too. Even stock. But it's if you GI away, you'll get hit by the back air. If you GI in, you'll get hit by a nair or an up air Maybe or something. Maybe like down away, down away, and then like. Well, Wario has like the amazing ability to react. Yeah, with your it, DI so easily. His, his, mo his mobility gives him a lot of options to work with. Yeah, I know. I've played a couple Wario's with my Captain Falcon. And oh. Back air, or back throw, back air off stage is like <laughs> it's impossible. Yeah. Fal there's a lot of characters where there's a lot of grabs you just can't get out of. Yeah. Like, Ivysaur versus Falcon. You can down throw to knee at any kill percent above, like, 80, and it's free. Oh, I'm talking about Wario on against yeah. Falcon. But yeah, yes, yes. Oh, okay. I understand, like, the grabbers. Like, it's sometimes you just can't get out. Yeah. That interrupts all of Squirtle's ground approaches. Mm -hmm. And, yep, yeah, and fires on the ground. Keep, yeah, keeping the fires on the ground is going to be very, Good. very important to, to limit, because you can... The movement that Squirtle has is...